Welcome to Always Dolls and thanks for joining us. Do your dolls like to get creative? Well, today we share with you how to make easy art supplies. Get busy crafting custom paint tubes, paint palette, brushes, a cute caddy, and a canvas similar to that in the new Truly Me set. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to support our channel. So, let's get making! A little higher, more, more, oh, too much, stop! Thanks, Kyle, it's perfect. No worries, happy to help. For your paint tubes, start with a sheet of computer paper. Mark, then cut six centimeter wide strips. Next, cut these into 10 centimeter lengths. Put glue on the top half of the strip and roll over a marker to make a paper tube. Make more. We did five in total. Next, crease the bottom one centimeter of your tube. Apply glue to the area and fold over to seal this end of the tube. You can vary the amount of folds to look like more or less paint has been squeezed out of the tube. To fill our tubes, we used hot glue. Put the nozzle into the opening, filling it up flush with the top. Push a small bead into the hot glue for the cap, then paint it white to match the tube. Or you can take the plastic play money from an Our Generation set and paint the blank side of the coin white. The side notches mimic the grooves seen in the Truly Me paint set. Again, attach by placing the coin into the hot glue to seal the top. Paint a narrow rectangle one side in the colour you want the paint tube to be. The American Girl set has black, white and the primary colours blue, yellow and red. For added details, write the paint colour in white gel pen and switch to a black pen for the white tube. We are recycling a cereal box for the paint palette. On the plain side of the paperboard, draw the classic palette shape. Ours is approximately 9cm long by 6cm wide. Cut out. Now trace and cut another from your paperboard. For the thumb grip, we used a standard stationary hole punch. Glue the paperboard palettes together. You can choose to paint the palette white or trace, cut and glue white poster board to the front and back for neatness and extra strength. Our 3D paint is corking. To match the Truly Me set, evenly mark out six spots on the palette. Position the nozzle over your pencil mark and squeeze a small blob of caulking. Drag the nozzle inward and flip to taper off the product. Leave for a few hours to semi-dry, then paint the raised paint blobs. Perfect! Up next, paint brushes. Start with skinny cocktail straws. Cut the blue straw at 6cm and the purple straw at 5cm. We will harvest the bristles from this old paintbrush. Coat the brush with liquid glue first and let it set before cutting off a small amount. Put more liquid glue at the base of your bristles, then insert into the cocktail straw. Leave to dry. For metal detail, we took this silver duct tape. Cut a 1.5cm strip and wrap around the top of the straw, slightly overlapping with the bristles. Pinch the tape firmly around the bristles for extra security. For a doll finger grip, we cut a loop from this girl's clear bangle. Attach it one centimeter from the end of the handle with hot glue. Repeat these steps with your shorter purple paintbrush. Now we have the paint, brush and palette, we need somewhere cute to store them. This image is from Instagram of a possible new AG set. Let's make a caddy like this. Here we will recycle two McDonald's dipping sauce containers. Clean thoroughly, then trim away some of the plastic rim so they fit together better. Measure and cut two rectangles of paperboard. Round the top corners, then cut a long slit from the top for the grip. Glue them together, blank sides facing out. Measure the height of your container and mark this on the paperboard. Cut just below this line. Under the pencil line, put a line of hot glue to attach your first container. Flip over and repeat on the other side, adding extra hot glue on the back. Affix your second container, pressing firmly. Put more hot glue at the joins, then trim down any excess paperboard. For a compartment divider, cut a strip of paperboard as wide as your container and pre-bend tabs. Hot glue in place as seen on screen. To match the AG picture, 
We painted ours a pastel peppermint colour. Once the paint has completely dried, pack your caddy with your art supplies and you are good to go. Let's finish with a super quick artwork. Here we screenshot and printed off the cactus picture from the set. For the canvas, cut a rectangle from thin 5mm or 3mm foam board. Apply glue stick and paste your picture to the foam board. Flip over and cut tabs, then glue them neatly to the back. So quick and so easy! If you enjoyed this video, we'd love it if you hit the like button and turned on the bell so you get notified as soon as a new video drops. See you soon for more miniature crafting fun!